Hey, Konya. Okay, I just got home. I brought curtains. I know I said I'm not staying in this house very long, but I can at least make it look decent without bringing in a ton of furniture. And, hold on. I don't think I have any information on this, but my Toomey package came in, so I'm super excited to open this and film like the little unboxing, unbagging. <laughs> Um, so I'm gonna film that real quick. I'm gonna do that like as a separate video. I've only ordered from Timu once before. I think I mentioned that yesterday actually. And it wasn't very many things. So I'm excited to see like more categories. I feel like Timu is becoming the new Shein. At first, when I shopped on it, it seemed very like sketchy kind of. And everything was cheap, but then when you go to check out, the shipping was like almost as much as like the cost of all the items so i thought i i don't know i kind of felt like a scam oh gosh my battery's about to die but anyway i think it was like a week ago my sister told me she ordered from there and she said that they were having free shipping and it's true so i got a ton of stuff and their prices were even cheaper and like some things most things are cheaper than shein but then there are some things that are cheaper on shein and more expensive on timu so i kind of check both and they're like the same exact things. So I'm gonna unbox this, do a little video. And I brought a couple things I had in storage that I forgot, like this. I bought this a little while ago for my niece. So I'll put it in her little like bag. And I have a couple more things downstairs. I'm gonna go grab it. Oh, Kanya, my phone. I mean, my camera's literally about to die. But I got a couple things. I wanted to add this to my sister-in-law's gift because I got her kind of like mostly home related things. Kunya, I know I haven't seen you all day. Um, I got her, I guess I can show you guys. Wait, it's either in the bag right behind the door or it's already at my mom's house under the tree. So I guess we'll check in a second. But anyways, I got this, which I picked it up today at the shop. I forgot I had this in storage and I realized I was like, this looks familiar. I bought something very similar on Timu, which should probably be Kona. Should probably be in that packaging, but it is different enough. So Alana's getting two new toys. I have this little clock. It's like a pink cat clock, um, which I'll probably give to my other niece. She better not be watching this video. And then this box kind of got damaged in storage, but I'll give that to my, to Alana, the little one. She's gonna have a lot of presents. It is in here, but I guess now I'm gonna need two bags because this one's already like overpacked. Ooh, it's like squished. But anyway, I got her this like brass bowl. So you see, it's like a little home aesthetic gift. I got her socks and gloves. I got everybody these gloves. They were new at the thrift store, so. I know some people are really weird about like used things, which I didn't really realize that until I got my friend one year, I got her like antique little like china. And way later she tells me that like she doesn't, like she feels really weirded out by used stuff. So I only shop like from thrift stores and stuff for like my mom or my sisters. Cause I know like none of us mind from the thrift store. Like we all love thrifting. So, and honestly, Yesterday I was saying how I was having a really hard time shopping for my mom. I'm realizing it's because I haven't been shopping at the thrift store for her gifts. <laughs> I have so much more luck shopping at the thrift stores and I just find so much more when I'm shopping at the thrift stores than I do in regular stores. And even like the more recent times that we went shopping at normal stores, we were like, this is not as fun as thrifting. Like we can't, we don't find anything. I mean, I find something everywhere I go. Because I'm, I just love shopping and I'm good at it. <laughs> But anyways, I got her this and I kind of like how the, the, I don't know if it's backwards to you guys, but there's like kind of like a gold J and her name is Julie. So I thought that was kind of cute. So I got that and this little like cutting boards. I feel like my camera's gonna die on me. And then I got her, I don't know why, I couldn't, I was running out of ideas, but this little, I showed you guys this, I think. I think I did because I feel like I mentioned I thought that this would be cute to put on the fridge and they can write little notes to each other. I don't know. And then just these little 
napkins. I think I showed that to you. Anyway, now I can What's gonna happen? My battery died. Um, anyways, I'm gonna film the little Tumi, not Tumi, Timu. That's gonna get really confusing. The Timu unboxing, I'm gonna film that real quick and then we can package her gift and wrap the stuff I brought from storage today and whatever's in this Timu bag that is part of the gifts. We can wrap all that together. So I guess you'll kind of see what I got in this video. So I'll see you guys in a second for you. Okay, so I filmed the Tumi I keep trying to say Tumi, but I'm meaning to say Timu. I filmed the Timu video. I wrapped one gift. Well, I just added rope into it. Let me go get it and show you guys. This is my little Santa bag of all the gifts I need to take to my mom's house to put under the tree. This was my mom's gift, and I added this little blue ribbon to it. Cute. Now I'm just gonna wrap the rest so you'll kind of see some of the things I got. Because some of this stuff, most of the stuff, is from Timu that I unboxed today. I like this hat for my nephew, and these little like pajamas. So I'll put that in a bag. I got this really cute set of like bags with the little cars on them and the little jingle bells. This one is like a 3D type. And then this really cute one. I guess I'll have to do the small one because everything else is kind of... Wait, where's the... It's hiding under the clothes. And this so this kind of stuff I have to put in a bag because there's no box to go with it. I'm guessing this little medium sized bag will work. Look how cute! Ah, oh, love it. Maybe I'll add some more things in there if I find anything else. Cute! Any tissue paper? I'm just realizing that this might be a bad idea because he will probably try to open it before Christmas. So I might have to keep this one here until Christmas Day. I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh Christmas memories Oh oh La da 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 Oh oh La da 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 Making our Christmas memories I've been wrapping presents for you I've been hanging marbles in the tree And I've lit my house with Christmas lights So you should come back home to me And when we wake up in the morning I'm gonna play the you love we'll be singing all the melodies until the sun comes up these are the good times with you baby this year is just gonna be you and me hang by the fire and chill isn't this how it's supposed to be making our christmas memories oh Forget about everyone else Isn't 
models where they don't have like the SD slot so I have to use the little SD adapter <sighs> I knew this was gonna happen one day I normally unplug like the adapter when I put it in my purse and I did it yesterday so I guess when I like pulled out my laptop it got like hooked and the part that goes into the laptop tore like the little C port so now I don't have it. Well, I do have an, I have a backup adapter, but it literally it'll stay plugged in, and it just keeps like losing connection or something, and it keeps saying like disk ejected or whatever. So like I can't edit my videos or transfer all the footage because it keeps like di disconnecting. So I have two videos already edited, and I have oh I need to turn in here. I have footage to film another one. Or I thought I did. I have to. I remember filming it, so I have to have another SD card at home somewhere with the Shein unboxing footage. Whoa, just sunny. So I need to edit that once I find it. But I have so far this vlog edited, except for this, obviously, that I'm filming now. Okay, I gotta move. So I have this vlog, which is just random, and I have a Timu unboxing. I made a pretty big order on Timu for the second time. The first time I ordered like three things so it hardly counts. This time I ordered enough to where I can like show you guys and let you know my thoughts on if like the quality is good and if it's worth the price. And I was really impressed with a lot of the items so that's gonna go live after this video and then I'm gonna edit that Shein video and I'm already itching <laughs> to make another Timu order. And I'm thinking there's a couple video ideas I want to do. I want to do a couple with different categories. So like order some like pet stuff on there and review it. Order like home stuff, decor and gadgets and review it. There is a tab under a dollar tab. So I want to order a bunch of stuff under a dollar and review it. I just want to do like a jewelry because you know me, I love jewelry. just want to do a jewelry order on there and review it. I think there's something else. Oh, I wanted to... So... Recently, I went through a cleanse of all my makeup, and I had so much makeup because if you guys have been here for a long time, which I doubt a lot of you guys stuck around, but my channel used to be strictly just like makeup. This guy's watching me talk. How awkward. Anyway, I used to strictly do just like makeup videos. Compared to what I used to, I do look a lot more natural makeup, and I just thought people didn't want to see that because I, th I thought everybody knew how to do their makeup, so I was like, that's not something crazy and chaotic. Why would anybody be watching? Because it's not like impressive. You know, I, I don't know. That's why I feel like I was so dramatic with my makeup looks all the time because I felt like people were only gonna watch it if it was like something that was like hard to achieve, like something dramatic and something they can learn from. So that was like what I thought when I, when I filmed videos. So I kind of stopped filming makeup videos when, once my makeup style changed and then I started a lot of like thrifting and shopping videos and like some like home decor or modeling or like furniture flipping now it's just everything and <laughs> it's random vlogs so I just post what I want 
them, what I want. But right now, we're gonna go into this liquidation store because my friend and I want to remodel the office at work and I'm gonna see if they have any like vanities or anything. So we have the office bathroom and then like the customer's women's and men's bathroom. So three bathrooms and an office that we want to remodel. So let's go in here and see what we can find. Almost forgot to turn the car off. <laughs> so we'll see you guys inside. Look at all these rugs. I actually really like this one. That one's kind of cool. And look at this artwork. This is so cute. I don't even have a fireplace. Not a real one. This one doesn't even have a price on it, but imagine like some logs in here. So cute. Oh, it's sold. Okay, so I found nothing. There is not a single vanity. Normally, there's vanities in there. I mean, I haven't been in there that many times, but the few times I've been in there, I've always seen a vanity. I guess I'll just have to keep looking. Anyway, I guess I'm just going home. Might film. I actually forgot that I have another Timu package sitting at home for like the past week, possibly longer, that I haven't filmed yet. So I can't, I cannot order anything else on Timu because I still have that to film and I have a couple videos to upload. So, new year. I know everybody's setting goals for this year. I am really gonna try to post every week, possibly even twice a week. I used to post twice a week back in the day. I don't know. My job just drains me. Not only is it that I don't have energy to film and edit every day, but I also don't do anything on weekdays. Like, I just go home. Maybe I go grocery shopping. You know, I just don't go out or do anything fun because I have to wake up really early for work. So, I just save the fun for the weekends. And this weekend is supposed to be really cold. They're calling for ice or snow or something. So I'm gonna be home. <laughs> I don't know what we'll do. Maybe we'll have to go to the thrift store and find something to DIY. That could be fun. I'm just gonna have to come up with ideas to film and be consistent. I'm pretty sure last year too, I kind of stopped setting goals because then it's really defeating when you can't like stick to the goals. So I didn't write any goals down this year of things I want to do because I don't know everybody always does that every New Year's they write all these like like unreachable almost goals because to start a new lifestyle I guess and like habits all like starting on one day is really unrealistic like it's good to set goals but to have all these goals and you're like okay I have to start this day it's kind of hard you know it takes like what 20 days a month to set a habit so just one thing at a time so i don't know it's a new year i'm feeling a little better i was really sad when <laughs> i mean new i was sick on new year's so i didn't do anything but i feel like new year's used to be exciting but now it's getting freaky because <laughs> it's already 2024 like can you guys believe that every year is just flying by faster and faster and that scares me so and honestly i mean i did have a good year 
but I mean, you know, there's things I wish I would have done more of, I wish I would have traveled more, I wish I would have, I don't know, I'm sure there's lots of things I wish I would have done, which is fine, we have another year. I am gonna set goals, but normally I feel like people set New Year's resolutions and they find things just to write down, just to set goals, and then they don't meet them, and then you feel defeated, and that's not a good feeling. I don't know, like, I'm just gonna really try to post weekly, and if possible, I'll post two videos a week, sometimes two, sometimes one, but at least one a week. Another goal would be to travel more this year. For sure, one video a week. That's about it for now. If I can get that in order, maybe I'll set another goal. <laughs> Who knows what? But anyway, I'm gonna go home. I'm honestly feeling really tired. I was thinking to film that unboxing, but you guys can probably hear it in my voice. I'm like, I have no energy. <laughs> Maybe I need a coffee. Maybe I'll go home and make a